I very much enjoy going to the beach. One thing that I can count on almost every day is that sometime during the day, it's going to get windy. But why do we have these sea breezes at the beach? Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science and Land and Sea Breezes. Land and sea breezes are considered local winds because they only travel a short distance. But what causes them? Like other winds, these local winds are a result of unequal heating of our atmosphere. Land and water warm up and cool off at different rates. This statement will help you understand land and sea breezes. It is, land always wins. What this means is that land both warms up faster than water and cools down faster than water. This unequal heating results in winds. A couple more statements will help. Warm air is less dense than cold air and will rise and create low pressure. Cold air is more dense than warm air and will sink and this creates high pressure. Air will always move from high pressure to low pressure. In other words, high to low is the only way the atmosphere will go. So as the sun rises and begins to warm the beach in the morning, the land begins to warm up faster than the water. A low pressure system is created over the land because it is warmer. The water is colder and has a high pressure. As a result, the wind will blow from the sea to the land. Wind is named from where it is flowing from, so this is a sea breeze because it's flowing from the sea. At night, the beach begins to cool down and the land cools down more quickly than the sea. As a result, the high pressure is now over the cooler land. The water is warmer and has lower pressure. The wind flows from the high pressure over the land to the low pressure over the water. It is flowing from land, so it is considered a land breeze. So remember, land always wins, and high to low is the only way the atmosphere will go. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.